Megan hides her dominished head as ordered think carefully about royal title used for dirty plot. Meghan Markle has been told to think carefully about using her Duchess of Sussex title in the US after her recent lobbying. Meghan Markle, 40, contacted Republican Senators Shelley Moore Capito and Susan Collins on their private numbers to ask to support paid parental leave and a climate policy. Democratic Senator Kirsten Gillibrand had given the numbers to the Duchess of Sussex and said she would be part of a group to work on paid leave long term. Royal expert Jonathan Sacadotti warned Meghan against using her title. Speaking to Express.co.uk, Mr. Sacadotti said, I think that there's a sense that Meghan has increasing ambitions but maybe more as an activist than as an actual politician. I think that would be a very bold step to go and do that especially if she constantly reminds everyone that she's the Duchess of Sussex. She has every right to use her title but I think involving herself more in politics especially in America, she may want to think carefully about the use of the title and any association between the royal family and a political cause like that. It is a political cause that many of us might support but regardless, to appear in more political contexts in America, I think would be increasingly challenging for somebody who is still keen to tie themselves to the royal family. Of course that doesn't mean she won't do it. However, Meghan Markle would have to abandon her royal title to run for political office. Meghan Markle has shown that she's willing to put the full force of her famous name behind royal causes. In the last two months alone, she cold called senators to pressure them to make paid family leave a reality, she and Harry took a stand for vaccine equality on a trip to New York, and their non-profit Archul just pledged to go net zero carbon by 2030. One reason for the outspokenness? Her rumored intentions to run for office, possibly, according to one source, for a Senate seat in California. But if she does, she may have to ditch her royal title because of, fittingly, the Constitution of the United States of America. Speaking to Express UK, Harvard professor Mark Tushinet pointed to Article I, Section 9, Clause 8 of the Constitution, called the Foreign Emoluments Clause which says that no person holding office shall accept a title of any kind whatever, from any king, prince, or foreign state without the express consent of Congress. And according to Tushnet, if Meghan Markle wants to run for political office, that's probably not going to happen, I don't think it's ever happened before. I think the chances of Congress allowing her to retain her titles would be very slim, he told Express. He continued, politically it would be quite damaging. I think, for her to retain the titles. Opponents will seize on anything, and this will be a hook to say well she's not really a true American. Recently, the former US President Donald Trump has accused the Duchess of Sussex of being disrespectful to the Queen and the royal family. In a wide-ranging interview with the politician-turned-broadcaster Nigel Farage, Trump said he thought the Duke of Sussex had been used horribly. The interview with Trump, 75, whose presidency ended in January 2021, took place in Florida on Monday and will be broadcast on GB News. Speaking about Meghan, Trump said, I'm not a fan of hers. I wasn't from day one. I think Harry has been used horribly and I think someday he will regret it. According to GB News, he added, I think Harry's been used and been used terribly. I think it's ruined his relationship with his family, and it hurts the Queen. In response to comments from Farage about Meghan using Duchess of Sussex-headed writing paper to lobby members of Congress, Trump, the first U.S. officeholder to be impeached twice, said, she is trying to do things that I think are very inappropriate.